This is part 7b in a series intended to teach you how to use the tools in the Family Search Research Wiki to find genealogy records for your ancestors in Italy. In part 7a, I showed you examples of baptism records and taught you how to find them if they are available online. Part 7b will be a case study where I take an actual family and demonstrate for you how to find them using the methods in Part 7a. We will be looking for Antonia Rossi. She was born on June 25, 1825 in the parish of San Rocco, Cassoni, Vincenza, Italy. This is a search strategy. We will find her birth record and then look for the births of her siblings. Also, the same techniques will be used to find birth records for her parents. Since Antonio Rossi was born in the province of Vicenza, we will now go to the Vicenza province page in the wiki. From the table of contents, click on church records. Under the first item, online digital records, we see a link to online records for Vicenza Cassoni. When we click on that, we come to an opportunity to search them by index. We fill out Antonia's name and her birthplace. We fill out her birth year, give or take a few years, just in case our source for her birth date was slightly off. We click on search and we come to a likely entry for Antonia. This Antonia Rossi was baptized on July 3rd. Baptisms were usually within a week or so after the birth, and so this time fits perfectly with our Antonia Rossi. Here are her parents' names, and by clicking on this view, it will show the record in a little card that's nice to print. Clicking on this miniature will take us to the original record. You always want to study the original record because it will contain much more information. Here in the original record for Antonia's baptism, she is the daughter of Francesco Rossi, which we already knew, but we have the phrase of Tofio added. And right after that, it says son of Giosafati, meaning that Francesco is the son of Giosafati Rossi. Likewise, right after the mother's name, Celestia Perocco, she is the daughter of Antonio, meaning Antonio Perocco. This phrase means that she is the second legal wife. Down here you have the padrini, which are the godparents. And frequently the godparents are related, and so you might pick up clues as to other relatives. Back in the index, we can change our search fields slightly to pick up any brothers and sisters of Antonia. We remove Antonia's name so that we pick up children of other names. I'm going to extend the birth range 10 years in either direction for now. Down here under relationship, we can now put in the parents' names since we know them. Francesco Rossi and Celestia Perocco. We update the search. This looks like four entries, but they're actually duplicates of two entries. But we pick up a brother, Giovanni, born a couple years after Antonia. Since we searched from 1813 up to 1825, and there's a 10-year gap, we can assume that Antonia is the first child. And since we ended our search in 1837, which is 10 years after Giovanni's birth, we can assume that he was the last child. Now that we know that Francesco was married before, we want to go back and find any children from his first marriage. So now we change the search fields by removing his second wife's name. And this brings up a baptism record for a Maria Rossi, born in 1823, to Francesco with a mother Pasqua Pasquoto, and uh, Giacomo Rossi, born in 1821, to the same couple. We will want to verify that this is the same Francesco, and we can do that quickly by looking at the original record, where we see that this is indeed Francesco Rossi di Tofio, the son of Giosafati. 
by manipulating the search fields with the different names of the parents and the grandparents and changing the dates to fit an earlier generation, we can start looking for the baptism records of the parents and the grandparents. For example, here's the baptism record of Celestia Parocco. She is indeed the daughter of Antonio Parocco. And now we pick up the mother's name. And by looking at the original, we pick up the names of the grandfathers. Antonio Parocco is the son of Giovanni Battista Parocco. And Antonia is the daughter of Giovanni Battista Polidora. Capital G-I-O period, capital B-A-T period, is an abbreviation for Giovanni Battista, a very common given name. When I checked the indexes, I wasn't able to find baptism records for the grandparents, which brings us to this last line of the strategy. People didn't travel very far, so if you don't find their records in the parish you're in, you begin searching nearby parishes for them. Now you are ready to go to Lesson 8, where you will learn how to find marriage records. The marriage records may also indicate neighboring parishes where these people were born.